All right, so in this video, I'm gonna explain how to use your entire forearm while aiming. This is a key mechanic that allows you to have insane mouse control while also having very fast flicks. Arm aim usually just means what it says, like it's aiming with your arm. This is how I aim. Basically what you just do is you flick as close to the target as possible with your arm, and then you actually micro adjust the rest of the way with your fingers and wrists. So you're not only using your arm, you're also using the rest of your body, you're just using your arm the most. Basically what separates this from wrist aim is that wrist aim involves using the arm and the wrist in the large part of your flicks, and then also the wrist and the fingers in the micro adjustments. The goal of aiming with your arm is to use a low sense so that you can move extremely large distances quickly with your arm and then you just micro adjust the rest of the way. A lower sense means you can be more accurate and this allows for easier micro adjustments. I aimed on 30 centimeters per 360 for a while, then I transitioned to 50 centimeters per 360 both times while arm aiming, and this increased my six shot sh scores by 17% when using the same motion both times. A lower sense isn't inherently better, and there are plenty of people who aim well on a higher sense due to the fact that aim is a combination of wrist, arm, and finger motion. However, the human arm can only move so precisely, so it is better to use a low sense when arm aiming. Basically what you want to do is take your forearm and place it on the edge of your desk. Which part of your forearm is up to you? You'll pivot off the point that touches the table. I personally like to pivot off the edge of my elbow. You could put your entire elbow on the table, but I personally don't like the feeling of that. I'd recommend pivoting from the bottom third of your elbow for arm aim. This allows you to maximize your range of motion, which is good because it allows you to move your mouse further, which means that you'll be able to play on a lower sense. Since you're not using your wrist very much, this will help you a lot. Basically, with this large range of motion, you can make really fast flicks despite the low sense, but also hit really close to the target. You then make micro adjustments to hit the target. If you want to learn more about those, check out the video on your screen, subscribe, and thanks for watching.